presentation of Scoreboard Precision Show featuring 2009 football teams in the Twin Lakes League on Smoky Hills Public Television is brought to you in part by Lincoln Grocery, a full-service food and next tech wireless agent, and Mini Mart and Quickway of Lincoln, both locally owned and operated full-service convenience stores. Go Lincoln Leopards, and good luck to all Twin Lakes League student-athletes. Farm Implement and Supply Company Incorporated, specializing in New Holland tractors, combines, hay equipment, sales, parts, and service. With locations in Plainville and Kobe, we also offer Crestbuster, Great Plains, Sunflower, Rhino, and Lawn and Garden Equipment. We understand what it takes to keep Kansas agricultural producers going. Their success is our number one goal. For almost 100 years now, UMB has been a bank people count on to weather the ups and downs of our economy. UMB stands for stability. We are time-tested, safe, and independent. We are waiting to help you at one of our many locations. Salina, Abilene, Russell, Luray, Manhattan, Hudson, and Wichita. UMB is here for Central and Western Kansas. UMB, where you can count on more. Hi, uh, Tony Brokish here with the Wilson Dragons. Um, head football coach now for 13 years. Coming off of last year's season, uh, we've been working in more of a wide open offense where we're looking at spreading, spreading the field out, uh, using our strengths, which would be our throwing game. Uh, we have some talented, talented individuals in the uh, passing and receiving part of our game. So we look at spreading the field, so more of a wide open attack. Uh, this year for the Dragons. Defense, we're probably going to keep it fairly simple. We'll probably have a base three front defense, maybe a uh, 34 look. Uh, something easy that we can uh, bounce around to from the different looks from our opponents. Uh, as you know, in eight man football, it's a wide open game, so you got to be able to make adjustments in a hurry. We feel the 3 4 defense allows us to make those adjustments, especially when we're still de dealing with some uh, young kids within our defense. Well, of course, uh, we return a, a core of athletes here as juniors, so we have five or six juniors coming back after last year's squad. So we definitely are, are looking better. We, we've matured physically. We've hit the weight room hard this summer, and uh, we've, we've got some nice seniors to go with this bunch of juniors. So we look to be, uh, at most, very respectable this year, and I think we're going to gain some attention towards playoff time. Looking at our league, I look for uh, the Chase Cats return just to practically about everybody now for two years in a row. They're coming off a, a solid season last year. They did, they did struggle with some injuries towards the end of the season, but I look for them to be, to be very strong early on. Uh, the Sylvan Grove Mustangs, of course, uh, return practically everybody from their uh, average season last year, I think. So they're looking at uh, building on top of that, and they're going to be highly competitive in our league as well. I'm Colby DeLiesel. I play in I'm a senior and my number is 12. Lucas, we've always been a rival with them. I look forward to playing Lucas here this year on homecoming. My name is Kenny Stanley. I'm the quarterback. I'm a junior and my number is 30. We're more experienced this year and uh, we're faster, faster football team, so we're planning to get a lot of points on the board and have a good defense. Well, we, we've worked at it all summer in the weight room. We've had some kids that uh, we talked about it last year when we ended the season. We were very young as sophomores mainly that we really need to develop as a team uh, with a purpose in the weight room through the summer. And we asked some kids to maybe step up and become, whether we're leading by example or, or vocal type leaders. I think our quarterback, Kenny Styrley, a junior, uh, his third year starting for us at quarterback, has, uh, has come out of that shadow where he is he's ready to lead the team. And I think he will probably be our, our main spokesman throughout the season. We have another junior, Cole Spears, a fullback and linebacker as well. Um, showed tremendous effort in the weight room this summer, and he leads a lot by example. So we're looking for good things out of those two kids. I think if, you're, if you like to watch a, a fast-paced game where there's a lot of action, whether it's throwing or running, uh, the eight-man football game, which includes the Wilson Dragons, no matter who we're playing, no matter what week it is, uh, you're going to see a, a, some, some great football this year from, from the Dragons as well as some of the area eight-man football teams. <laughs>